ready? One, two, three. Welcome back to our channel, your favorite place for hauls, home decor, and all things homemaking. If you're joining us for the first time, welcome. If you're returning, we appreciate your support. <laughs> this week's video, we are going back, back to school. On Monday, I am so excited for her. She is going to be entering second grade yes child so if you're interested in seeing all of the wonderful things that i got for her and maybe a little idea of how she's feeling about returning to school on monday stay tuned okay guys let's jump right in now i want to share with you first the supplies that i got for her as homeschooling so for homeschooling her i only homeschool her on weekends because typically she gets home maybe around 5 30. by the time she gets home it's it's time to eat dinner. We usually do some reading. I will have her do a little bit of journaling, just two or three sentences tops, just to create a habit and ensure that she's continuing to build her skills of storytelling. That's it. That will probably take her 10 minutes for journaling and we read for about 20 to 30 minutes every night, okay? On the weekends is when she'll probably get about an hour of learning each day, Saturday and Sunday. And typically I have it prepared. So I'll show you the supplies that I'm planning to do so that it's kind of independent work and I won't have to be there for the entire hour. She gets to do that. And then after that, we have fun for the rest of the day. Okay, so homeschooling stuff first. The other thing I wanted to share with you guys is that her school policies that they do not give homework. They will give the um, homework sheet that will say, you know, I don't know, practice telling time or practice your even and odd numbers, things like that. Although she already knows that's what they share. Um, they may also tell her to read for 20 minutes a day. Outside of that, they don't give any worksheets or anything like that. That's why I make sure that she continues to read with me every night in the journaling. And then on the weekends, we do some additional learning that is clearly more advanced than what she gets in second grade. Okay. So, Piggy, let's show them first the uh, supplies we have for home. So, I got them these, I got her these two folders. This is for home. But outside of this, she will have, um, I don't know where they, oh, the folder's there. So these two folders, one's going to be for Saturday, one's going to be for Sunday. I'm going to probably include some of the work that she will do, worksheets. I'll rip them out the books and then kind of have instructions for her and it makes it just easier for her. So whatever I'm doing on a Saturday, whether it's I'm editing a video or if I'm cleaning the house or something like that, she already knows what to do. It's pretty uh, self-explanatory. Let's show them what else we got. We got these. Like we got these markers. We got these colored markers and these colored crayons. Absolutely. And then we also got these. We got some erasers, pink, blue, and orange erasers. Mm -hmm. And what is this for? This is like for my pencils. These are like a pencil case to put all of my pencils inside for when I go over by Auntie Mama. Yeah, so when, she, when we go over, if we spend the weekend by my girlfriend's house, what we like to do is I like to just put everything in those folders and then also markers everything like that goes into that pencil case so she has everything she needs to be able to do her one hour of work and, and we got these two like notebooks mm -hmm. we're gonna be right journaling in those show them your pretty face baby you're gonna be doing what we're gonna be journaling in them yes we will be doing the journaling <laughs> right and then um i oh i thought her two books because so one will probably be for journaling. Um, the other one will probably be for scrap paper because a lot of times she likes to be able to, when she's doing her four and five uh, digit addition, she sometimes likes to do a little bit of, um, she needs a scrap, some scrap paper, so I like to offer her that. And then also when she has spelling tests as well, if we do any spelling tests, that's a great space for her to, to use um, for her spelling tests. So that's it. Yeah. Now we're gonna get into her school, school supplies. Stuff. I'll let her lead that. We'll go pretty fast through that because I know everyone has school supplies, but this is stuff that we got off of the school supply list. And secret, let me tell you what I did. Got the school supplies. That night I came home, I set up Target for um, a drive pickup. So I didn't even have to go into Target because I know it's a madhouse right now. And they got everything I needed and dropped it right in my trunk. Everything. Everything, yes. guys. Everything. So let's show them what we got. What's the first thing? So the first thing we got is like this backpack. It's a unicorn backpack. As you can see, I love unicorns. I have them all over my room. That's correct. And this is going to be a hanged up in my room too. Yes. Okay, so you know, guys. So you know. <laughs> Okay, now we're going through our school stuff. I got these colored 
like markers. Mommy mm -hmm. may start handing them. Mm -hmm. We got these band-aids for if we get a rash or a cut. Mm -hmm. And we got these crayons. Mm -hmm. We got these like papers so I could do math. And oh, this is actually, I'm so sorry, Patey Witty. This is uh, for home. This isn't for school. So again, this is for me to make like flashcards for spelling, um, uh, flashcards for multiplication, addition, things like that, or any type of math vocabulary words that she may be struggling with i like to have these so that we can practice them at home i was wondering why you put them in there i'm starting to crash my head after that <laughs> so then what else you got baby girl we got these crayons like a big box of crayons i oh, mean like crayons <laughs> they look like crayons they're huge they're purple crayons come oh. on they're purple crayons <laughs> what are they tell me what they say they're glue sticks that's right girly I want to name stuff my own name. <laughs> we got these paper towels. All requested by the teacher. Show them what else. Show them what else. Yes, we got these pencil box mm -hmm. to put my, all of my pencils in. Mm -hmm. We got some erasers, mm -hmm. like pink, blue, and orange erasers. Mm -hmm. And this is separate from her homeschooling items. Mm -hmm. And another box. She had requested two boxes of crayons. Crayons. Mm -hmm. Another box of crayons. Mm -hmm. I we think got, she requested two and I bought three. It's fine. Yep, we got the like, we got a, like a lot of like dis wipes. Like, dis wipe, what? Dis, disinfecting, disinfecting wipes. Good job. Um, I think she, she asked for five of them. So we got five. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we got the, and we got some pencils. Yeah, she here. asked for two packs of those. So I think there should be another one in there. We got some markers. Yeah, the like dry erase. She asked for two packs of these as well. Expo walk markers. Yeah, that's what the, that's the brand name. She is. asked for two bottles of soap. Mm -hmm. And what's her name? Who's she? Mrs. Clark. Her name that's is Mrs. My Clark. New, that's my new teacher for second grade. And uh, while you're showing them that, tell them tell them uh, something special we learned when we saw her. We saw my God. She's got a baby. Mm -hmm. Well, she doesn't have the baby yet. She's what? She's going to be pregnant. And she is pregnant, and she's going to have the baby really soon. I think probably within the next couple of weeks. So yep, she'll have a substitute teacher other, for a couple months. But go ahead. Here are the other pencil that mommy was talking about. Mm -hmm. What else? Here's some like scissors for you to cut. I need a, much more scissors because I need a pair for home too. Yeah, I thought I bought, I think I bought two of these. I think it's just probably in another bag because she needed some at home as well. She loses them. Ooh. And then what else? Here we go. Here's some tissue boxes mm -hmm. to put in case I got my nose. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's for school. They requested that as well. <laughs> Show them what else you got, Mama. Okay, we got these like storage um, quarter slide, um, slider storage, quart slider storage. Quart. Yeah, okay. these are also requested by the teacher probably for storing different things or activities and stuff like that. She said black and white notebooks, but instead they didn't have the black and white ones, so we're going to use the blue and black ones. Yeah, they. Did. she asked for the black and white. I'm, I mean, I don't know, it makes a difference, but they didn't have it. So I'm, I'm sure those are the first they went out of, but we got four. She needed four of those. What else did we get, Mama? We got the, like, um... We got a wide roll notebook. Yeah. Some pur two purple ones. Yeah. They're kind of like a little different because of these little here. These are spiral. They're called spiral notebooks. Yep. They're um. They have like paper. They have the paper things. The paper covers. Yeah, it's like a softer cover for her. Um, so she asked for the marble composition books as well as the spiral, and then I separately more <laughs> she asked for four of these folders. So these are for school, separate from the homeschooling ones we showed at the beginning. So let's go to the next box. What else do we have? We have three boxes. Oh my gosh, my box is one a lot. Okay, we got like. Oh, okay, so this. We don't have to show them this because this is something mommy got you from Miami. Now, these pair of sneakers. They're um, like JoJo CY's peak yes. sneakers. The um, size is good. I think it's a size 13. This is um, has like all pink and it's really nice. I really like it. It's kind of tight for me, but inside it could pass. It could really pass. 
I don't think it's, it's I think it was tight because the, the lacings were a little bit tight, but as far as the, the size, it's perfect. Um, if you've watched our previous video where I did maybe a TJ Maxx haul a couple months ago, I did have these. She hasn't worn them yet. They're brand new. I decided to save these for um, school because they were a little bit big for her at the time and she's grown again. So they're like the right size for her now where they're not slipping off of her foot. You yeah. wanna show them the other pair of sneakers you got? Yeah, these pairs. We got like these pairs of shoes. And, and Reebok Classics. Boop, 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 um, boop, I don't think I've shown these before. Uh, I love them though. I love the Reebok sneakers. Classics for her. Um, and they, they clean really well. Although they're all white, I love the Reebok Classics. Um, they're like the leather ones. They clean very easily if she gets them scuffed up. So I do love those. Yeah, just a trick. Um, if you use the magic eraser on them, get a, you know, just get a little wet and then rub it. It gets those scuffs out. No problem. Mommy, one, um, one girl on TikTok, I heard this in New York. Mm -hmm. One girl on TikTok, she used mag magic eraser to erase stuff off her teeth. Really? Yeah, but never do that. Never do that. Yeah, I don't think I would, but that's interesting. Very interesting. Okay, you want to show them the other pair of sneakers you got? Yeah, these are the um, sneakers that mommy's girlfriend bought me. Okay, Auntie Momo got her these. It sneakers. says human race. Yeah, um, they're still. These are still. I, we really shouldn't have shown these because these still don't fit her. They're still a little bit big for her. Um, but they're so cute, and I have them too. So maybe we'll get some pictures if you're following on Instagram. No. But they're still a little bit too big for her. They are a size, they're a size one, but they, it, it slot, her foot slides right out. And it's strange because this is a size one too. It's just a different cut. So for now, those are still going to be on the side. But oh, and just so you know, these were only $24.99. I thought that was a great deal. Um, and I got them at Marshall's. Here's some stuff that, um, some clothes that mommy got. Yeah, I got this for her in the summer. She hasn't worn it yet. Um, I don't think she'll be wearing this to school. It's brand new. I still, as you can see, tags are still on it. I got it from Zara. I got it from Zara, but um, she is going to be wearing uniform. That was a question for a while. I wasn't sure if they were going back to uniform, but they're very, um, they're not very stringent with the rules. So they are asking them just to wear a navy blue top um, bottoms, they can wear whatever they want. Yeah. I'm gonna play around with that a little bit. I ordered a few things. Some stuff still didn't come in, so I'll definitely do a part two to this. This that men, That's funny you mentioned that. We're going on to the um, homeschool clothes. I oh. mean, not homeschool, school clothes. Correct. What am I saying? Segue. Yeah, here's a little skirt. Inside it feels like a pants, but it's actually a skirt on the outside. You remember what mommy said it's called? It's called a skort. 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 Yes. Yeah, or culotte. Like, Some people call them culotte. Um, the cut is like a skirt, and it's like a short. So the ending of short and the beginning of skirt. Correct. That's that's what they call them, skort. So this one, um, what I love about them is because then I don't have to worry about wearing the bloomers underneath. I did purchase. They didn't come yet. I did purchase like uh biker shorts as you guys know i always like to have that for her because again she's still not mindful of her Ooh. body when they're playing on the on in the playground and things like that i just like her to have shorts if she's ever wearing a skirt so i did get her this khaki skirt um let's show them what else we got i got this shirt but i think i'm gonna have to return it it's a little bit big for her um but i do, i purchased this for her last year in a smaller size but she's outgrown it so that's why i got her that one you and we got this that? big white dress it's kind of like inside have a white shirt yeah it's connected. connected it looks like it's it's uh combined it. they're combined in together combined combined there we go yeah combined it. <laughs> Com combined not combined it okay? okay this is um a french toast i actually got it at tj maxx amazing deal this was only 8.99 mm, so um toast? and it yeah, that's the <laughs> that's the name of the uh, of the brand, <laughs> silly girl. Okay, get get something else in there while I show them this one. I got her the same khaki skirt in a navy blue, and I got her a cardigan. Uh, super cute. I, I got this one at Marshalls. I love the detail on this on the the um, pockets right here. I thought that was super cute, um, and that was uh, $9.99, the, the jacket. Yeah, Mommy got me this little snack. It's called Sweet Beef. It has like uh, candy beads and string inside. Yeah, I don't know why that's in the back to school thing. That was just something I randomly got her before. Yep, you could put it on your neck, and then you could start eating it for a snack. Yep. Mommy All right, I also mommy got, got her... 
um, Ooh, mommy got me this flexible array, um, ruler. I started using it and I thought, hmm, probably this is useful. I mean, not useful. Yeah, useful. Yeah, um, I she has one at home already, but I thought this was kind of cute for school. But they didn't ask for it, so I might end up just keeping it at home. Yeah, uh, I thought um, I thought I thought this would be useless because it will, I thought it would make me do bad lines. It was just for no, me no, no. It it holds it really well. She's yes, it right. Does. It holds it very well. Uh, when it's on the paper, it doesn't move around or anything like that. Uh -oh. I got her these in the Target buy section. You know that's my favorite. If you follow us on Instagram, I show you guys all the awesome things I get there all the time. It's five minute quizzes. I love this. This is an example of something I would probably have her do in the morning before school. It's just maybe about 11 problems real fast and she should be able to complete it. Now this, she would complete clearly less than five minutes. It's not that long, but it's nice and it gets harder as it goes through. So these are just some great things. You can always go to Target buy section and find some awesome stuff. I also got some practice pages. God bless you, baby. And uh, for addition and multiplication. Next thing we have are some socks. I have these socks that I got from Target. I love Cat and Jack. I find that their clothes wash very well. I yeah. haven't gotten the socks from them before, so we'll have to see how that goes. Oh, I'm wearing a Cat and Jack right now, I think. Yeah, the den the, the denim jeans you have on our uh, and Cat and Jack. And Mommy is wearing a Cat and Jack right no, that's okay. That's for kids, girly. Okay, so here we are. This is a, a dress that I got for her. I love this. It's from the children's place, but I actually got it at TJ Maxx. Let me show you the other one because I bought two of them. This one, so you can see the bow, how cute it, it um it looks here and it's really nice it looks like it won't be too bad when it comes to ironing looks like it'll wash pretty well but $26.95 I got it for $5.99 at TJ Maxx so of course you know I bought two of them the last thing we're going to show Paige go ahead and show them what mommy got you this mom this book um this book is like mom actually this is not a whole book it has like four chapters mommy you four books, books. Four books. It's a series. Yes, it is. Wait, I can watch this on TV? No. So this is, it's called a book series. Anytime you have a book that comes, I mean, a set of books that come as a boxed set, it's called a series of books, okay? Oh, I thought it was a show too. Um, um, no, but I, we could look and see. Maybe Amelia Bedelia might be a story, a uh, show too. We can look that up. Oh yeah, and like um, that show about that mouse, that ballerina mouse. Oh, yes, I know exactly which one you're talking about. That's also a book. I can't remember right now. I'm going to place that book here because I don't remember. Yes. But I know which one she's talking about. It's with this uh, this little mouse, and I think she's English. Um, it's it's super cute, but it's also, a, it's not only a, um, it's a on book, Netflix. it's also on Netflix as well. Yes, yeah, so we have this. It says, you know what's funny? It says Amelia Bedelia box set, even though it was, has a box with a whole lot of books. Mm -hmm. And Amelia Bedelia is written Amelia Bedelia. See if you can see. Mm -hmm. And tell them which, tell them about, um, you read one of these books already, right? Yes, I have. Oh, mommy, look, she's in a book. <laughs> so tell, tell them about the book that you read. Which one did you read already? You have Amelia Bedelia Goes Wild, Road Trip, Unleashed, and Means Business. Which one did you read? We read Unleashed. I thought you, I, I wanted to start reading Amelia Bedelia and had a splash, even though you had Amelia Bedelia had Unleashed. So you, you, but you read Unleashed. Who'd you read it with? I read it with grandma. What'd you think about it? I think it was really nice and nice. I really liked about um one I really like about Sherlock when he found Peer. Peer is Charlie's dog. Now um, all the skateboarders used to make fun of Charlie and say, That's your girlfriend. Oh, okay. Well let me tell you Over guys. The, bull, the funny the thing is I grew up reading Amelia Bedelia. So I was really excited to get this. Anytime we're starting a new school year, I always try to get her a few books. I actually got her another one that we, we didn't show here, but um, I got her, uh, what is it called? The Night Before Second Grade or something? Yeah, it's called The Night Before Second Grade, but it's called Second Grade Here We Come. Oh, that's what it's called, Second Grade Here We Come. So last year I got her, it's becoming like a tradition. I got her when she was in kindergarten, one that was like, are you ready for kindergarten or something? And then I think the first grade book was called the night before second grade this yeah, one is one. called cool. second grade here we come so we usually try to read it the night before <laughs> her first day of school it's just but a little we tradition forgot we have the first grade what? first grade we did forget we forgot to read it the night before but we ended up reading it the first day of school that evening <laughs> and that was like our book for the next day so that's just our little tradition no my life is ruined because <laughs> are you done
one. Okay. <laughs> A bundle of energy we thank you guys so much for staying with us until the end if you like this video make sure you comment below with two things that you are getting your kids before they go back to school in addition comment below with when your kids are starting back school i feel like she's starting back school so early as you guys know we are from new york so for new york they typically start back school like the weekend after labor day so this is like i feel out of sorts it's a little crazy but we are excited we are blessed she came back from new york safe and sound she had so much fun make sure you follow us on instagram because we just finished doing an IG live where Peyton shared all of the fun things that she did this summer. We appreciate you guys so much for watching. Make sure you Please head over watch. to Instagram and make sure you follow us there. And what else do you want to say? Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. I mean, Flitter. <laughs> Twitter. <laughs> Come it's on. Okay. It's Twitter. The, but the bird flies. Tweet, tweet. That's why it's called Twitter. We appreciate you guys so much for no. watching. Until next time. Shuffle my elbow so show. Oh, that dust is on you. Oh, let me get that off. Thank you, sis. Thank you, sis. I get a little moisty, a little bit. <laughs> Lord, help us through this. Ready? Yeah. All right, sis. Let's All right, see. sis. Let's see. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I will appreciate Sure, thank like I can say it. <laughs> you just hit me in my boob. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it should start with the F because it flies. All right, but honey, it's Twitter. Well, I'm changing it to Flitter. Okay. I can have my own opinion. Hi, guys. I get my own opinion here. <laughs> it's Flitter for her. You want